seeing that Captain Elliot is about to be roasted to a crisp, Abrams rushes to pull him out. The flames on the boy's body get hotter and hotter, and Clemens rushes to grab his feet and throws the boy into the sea. Everyone has been cornered by the monster, but they can't find out where it is. Anna believes that the ship must be destroyed for the monster to be buried at sea for good. Darkness falls again, and everyone goes into full armor. Two crew members ambush the mast, ready to blow the monster's head into a twist. Instead, the monster appears in the air and quickly drags away Abrams, who is torn to pieces in the blink of an eye. Another crew member, Olgren, tries to get back on deck as quickly as possible, but unfortunately, the monster is already on him. Luckily Ogurun wasn't killed by the fall, and knowing that there was no way everyone could defeat the monster, he pulled out a hoe and started chiseling away at the ship, ready to die with it. But the monster soon caught up with him, and sent him straight to his death with one bite. The monster then set sights on Elliot and quickly took his life. With his companions all killed, Clemens angrily provoked the monster, telling it to come out and fight him alone if it had the guts. The arrogant monster did emerge, spreading its wings like a giant bat. After hissing, it lunged at him. And just as the monster opened its bloody mouth, it was suddenly shot in the back. Anna was still alive. The monster immediately rushed over to her and wrapped her up in its wings. Clemens took an axe and pulled Anna to escape. But before they could get more than a few meters away, the monster caught them again. The monster lifts him into the air with one hand and keeps teasing him with his fingernails. Anna takes this opportunity to cut the cable and the mass falls hard. The two quickly jumped into the sea and escaped from the merchant ship by grabbing the wood. But instead of sinking into the sea, the broken merchant ship drifted down the waves to the shore. The monster is also not fatally injured and soon breaks free. After they drift at sea for a night, Anna's eyes surprisingly turn white as well. She knew she was about to turn into a monster, and in order not to hurt Clemens, she held on to her last bit of consciousness and rode alone in the direction of the rising sun, and then completely turned into ashes in the sunlight. Clemens is rescued shortly afterward, and his experience on the ship becomes a lingering nightmare. But what he never expected was that Dracula had followed him and had mixed into the human world in disguise. To Clemens' shock, 